Hey there, everyone. We are here. We're firing up Grim Dawn. We're going to get some crucible farming going for you guys today. How's everybody doing? <clears throat> All right. So. Good start. I got, first. I got to figure out where the hell to do the crucible at. I'm assuming it's around here somewhere. All right. So theoretically, the crucible should be. Huh? Where the hell would the crucible be, guys? Does anybody know? Anybody? 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 All right. Let's see. I just need to know where the location is. I don't even really need a guide. All right. Do, 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 do. No, it is from the main menu. It's my bad. Crucible. All right, let's take him to the crucible. shall be rewarded fail and you know and you know only my scorn shit Oh shit. Should probably get out of that area. Alright. Crucible of the Sands. Oh, demons.
and slits. Oh, that's a fucking boss. Alright, fair enough. Let's do a let's do a death chill beacon. Okay, so that's remake those thingy mobobbers, good to know. Alright. Do another round. You don't get XP in the Crucible, that's rough. So I need to get my level up, that's what I need to do. Oh, spiders. Oh, boy, no. Should have at least let us have experience for this. Would have been the polite thing to do. close. Come on, kill it, kill it. Wish to collect my reward first. Okay. Your reward awaits you in the treasure chamber. Empowered metalist cloth. Ooh, that's nice for freaking... Freaking poison nova build. Jesus, or cabalist build. God, good night. Alright. to rank 20 on that one. Obviously, I'm going to need to go higher level, but it's 
All right. Let's see here. Bogdan Bloom. A Dread Skull. exit in that direction. Good to know. Okay, that's a vendor. That's my item guy. skeletons though never mind all right none of that stuff is any good all right so if I want to dismantle something Dismantling costs dynamite. Let's not sell. Let's not use all of our dynamite on dismantling shit. Oh. And belt. Spirit guide. Immortal archmage. Eighteen tributes. Shit, all I've got is the one fucking beast tincture left. I went through thirty of those. Good night. I go through 30 freaking tinctures. Jesus. And you only have. Talk to the master of the crucible. Just wish you could get XP from it, you know? It'd be a good way to farm additional XP.
All right, so far I'm liking the crucible. It's a good farming environment. Demons! Come on, kill it. The Inferno, Burst of Flame and Nearby Enemies, Stormcaller, Chain Lightning to reduce resistances. Kill that thing in there, thank you. Piss. Destroy them. That didn't work out as well as I had hoped. I guess this is what happens when things don't come after you. Oh shit! Everything's here! Woo! Jesus. Crucible can be pretty uh 
pretty freaking intense. I'm gonna go one more round, go see if I can make it up to 30. And then I probably go back to the main story and level up. Considering, oh shit! No, no, no! Damn it. <laughs> oh, all right. Dun, 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 da, da. Well, at least I still get loot. Not much. But some loot. Definitely not what you normally get, but... Can't be too mad. I'm assuming the farther you go, you get stuff like there and there, and probably on those sides. At least that would be my assumption. Alright. Alright, we'll go back to the main story. Or to the back to elite difficulty, the main story. Main campaign. Except. We are on elite. Except. in here. Come on. And one more round of summoning. Can only imagine how much different Crucible is with something like the uh, uh, Ethereal Aether casting as opposed to using skeletons because really this, uh, a lot of this one just depends on my placement for my skeletons you know where they go what skeletons I get even but it is what it is and I don't want to go that way that stuff is bad Freaking cracked aether bullshit's what that is. Mine. Oh, I never did go talk to that dude in Dead Man's Gulch either. Oh well. Let's not get ourselves killed from being stupid. Getting killed because I get overpowered is one thing, but getting killed because I was being dumb and not paying attention to my health is a whole nother ball game. Short pauldrons of spell weaving, those might be decent. Balls. Oh shit. Yeah, so about that. Motherfucker. Jesus. Are you... Come on now. There we go. 
full contingent. That's too bad I don't need your damn plate mail. Just wanted to explore this side of the farm because I hadn't explored it fully when I came through it earlier today. Whew. I forgot those guys exploding like little fountains of freaking aether. Missed something in the pines? I mean, it's whatever, but strange. I don't know which one I missed. All right, that man's gulch. They are all right around the corner here. There you go. Go to homestead, guys. It's all good. back up to homestead I gotta go back into homestead and double check for quests to make sure I didn't miss anything Let's see what did this guy watch ah see yeah. Ulgrim middle age black legion grumpy I will track down this abomination. Okay, that's that guy. That's a vendor person. Empowered Hermit's Leggards. 36% all day. Whoa. <clears throat> oh, shit. Bonus experience gained on that one. Hello, my friend. Let's get rid of all this green stuff here. Because we are obviously not going to be using it. That might be worth keeping a hold of, though. So let's see here. Offensive ability. Actually increases my DPS. Yeah, we'll use that one. We'll sell the Mark of the False Gods off. Um lose a shit ton of DPS with that. And let's see what this does. I get increases across the board with the empowered hermits laggards over the shade leather. Alright. You are stash keeper man. Time, right? All right. Actually, let me talk to this guy here. Does this have anything on it? No. So I need a good cast-based weapon one. So let's see. Used in head armor. Used in chest armor. It gives me a sh pretty good defensive ability, but I don't want to use anything yet really let's see using shields using shields used in all weapons shields caster off chance mark of dreeg because that would grant me dreeg's infinite gaze so let's throw that on there
So this now has Unleash the gaze of Dreeg. That's actually really good. Let's clear that slotch. Let's clear that slotch. Actually, let's put Dreeg here. Let's just clear that out. Okay. Pumps. Some armor plating on to get me more physique. Let's see. Control hide tool tip. There we go. All right. So spine carapace gives me piercing retaliation, twelve percent all retaliation damage, and twenty four additional armor. Also get mutated scales, which gives me extra health. So we'll definitely go ahead and use that. Buddy of mine just started playing Elder Scrolls Online, which I didn't think I would ever see. That's just weird. He's not a big MMO player. And to see him actually start up Elder Scrolls Online is a little terrifying, to be honest. Anyway, that's a that's a fun game I haven't played in forever too. All right, let's continue on the quest. Oh man, I gotta run through all this crap. Oh god, that stuff sucks. Yeah, these things are all... Jesus Christ. These things are just a few levels higher than I am right now. Obviously missed some stuff on my previous playthrough. <laughs> I must have missed some level... Leveling areas or something. Not a who knows. I just wish you could level with uh, the Crucible. That'd be nice, but... Crucible is strictly for item grinding. But other than that, I enjoy the Crucible. It's fun. I mean, I only made it to round 21, but, you know, I'm also a pet build. I'm a pet build, and I'm currently in Elite Difficulty, where pet builds tend to take a piss. But if, if, if I can make it through pet build, or through... Elite, I'll be golden because then I'll be able to do some serious damage with a pet build. No, no, no. Ah, son of a bitch. I missed my freaking health potion. Entirely too squishy with literally no build up. No health regen. Alright. Find Dolly in the mountain deeps. Mountain deeps wasn't that. There's Homestead, Prospector Trail, Withering Fields. Mountain Deeps, I'm assuming, are somewhere completely different. Do need to go do that, though. Okay. I'll do that later. Right now, I want to go destroy the uh, amalgamation and recover the cannons. Mother of a I keep getting hooked on shit. Damn it. Alright. I 
I need a freaking Arcovian effigy. Or Arcovian relic. I think it's called the Relic of Arcovia. Oh! Yeah, get in here. Yeah, take that shit out. Don't worry about the shit that's outside there. Please and thank you. got tank character. We got tank pets for a damn reason. Quit chasing me around. Fucking bag of asses. No. Again. Freaking tanks. I mean, these things are freaking six levels higher than I am. dynamite on me. Woo. All right. Grab some dynamite. can all be vendored. Or not vendored, but dropped into the bank. <clears throat> Why do you keep wanting to come down here? Okay, you killed it. Good. Let's go up here. Blow our way through this thing. And let's go kill that shit. Oh my fucking god. That's a little mini boss. Oh, yeah, there's a fucking ethereal rift. <sighs> Let's clear out around it first. Before we decide to go play with chaos energy. Let's face it, that's what we do when we go into ethereal rifts, is we like to play with chaos energy. Alright, good enough for me. Let's go play with chaos energy, shall we? find some fairly good loot in these areas, which is one of the reasons I like to come out here and do them. 
Oh, shit. Nope, nope. Oh, you motherfucker. I don't like being so freaking squishy, man. Being squishy sucks. It really does. <clears throat> Thankfully, I had popped a freaking portal. Back in, especially because I mean, XP is hard as fuck to come by now. Oh hell no! Get away from me, bro. I ended up just getting freaking pinned behind him. It fucked me over. Oh shit, 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 nope, nope, keep that guy away from me, keep him away. You don't want things to beat on me. Especially freaking Umber Hulks. Or the Flesh Hulks. Guys are pretty. I mean, the fact that they're all freaking, you know, four or five, four to seven levels over me does not a happy camper make. But unfortunately, it's just what happens. that boss already are you kid come on kind of want to make a freaking super tanky character now I am just hemorrhaging XP, man. The damn squishy Path of Exile character all over again. That time he died just fucking fine. Alright. Alright, how... Okay, we can't get over into that area yet. But we can go this way real quick. Clear this area out.
See, now it's angry. We done made it very angry this time. It's freaking ethereal terraformers. Nope, 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 nope. Oh, you son of a bitch. God dang. This character is just super, super god dang squishy. It's a pure necromancer. Again, it doesn't help the area I'm at. They're all higher level than I am. But we can't let it win. We have to close the Aether Rift. Why do I get stuck, man? There it goes. I'll take that soul shard, thank you. Don't run through it and it won't hurt you, dummies. other if I could click it'd be great all right some scrap what else do we got in here anything really nothing else in here just scrapping guys why is that following us? What the hell? Go away. We don't want none. Jesus Christ. Hey, can I have my freaking behemoth back? Thank you. Hey, what's going on, furry man? You headed off to bed? Or are you saying night is in good morning or good hello? Good evening.
some shit. Nope. Got it. Don't wander farther that direction. Makes a certain amount of sense. Nope. 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 Oh, ho, 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 motherfuckers. Y'all got lucky. Whew. Ah, bed. Ah, here you are. Alright, man. Good night. Have a good night. <clears throat> no, I had... Mm, can you guys quit destroying my fucking gargantuans, please? It'd be great. Yeah. And my skeletons for that goddamn matter. Hey, Chaos Theory. Thank you very much for the 10 bits. Focus isn't. I'm tired of dying in this stupid Aether Rift, man. I've died like three times in it already. I've got no chaos resistance, so these things just eat me alive. I don't want to die. I'm playing an uber squishy freaking necromancer. Ah. New name? Obviously. I'm assuming it's a new name. Because that would just be silly for you to have like three freaking different accounts. I've seen Stranger, but it would still be weird. Really wish I had the new God of War. I'd stream that. But, uh, yeah, I don't, uh, don't have the scratch for that. What the hell makes it? Why is... I don't know why we have stupid Aether things following us, chasing us, and destroying my freaking minions. Oh, nice. I mean, I know I'm going to freaking die again. It's just going to happen. That's the problem with these pure pet builds is they're so goddamn squishy. Especially the Necromancer build. There's not a lot of great necro, necro sets that I've seen. Clusters. Very nice. <clears throat> oh, no, no, don't. Don't go toe-to-toe -to -toe with the abomination. It's just a bad idea. Turns out I've been hitting the wrong freaking button, and I keep resummoning my freaking minion. Or my freaking, uh, what is Rot Fiend. Blight Fiend. Blight Fiend, not Rot Fiend. Uh, this one is not Warhammer Realms, actually. This one is, uh, Grim Dawn. It sounds Warhammery because of the whole Grim Dawn thing. Um, but it's actually made by a, a company called Crate Entertainment. And they are formed from the, uh, a lot of former people from, um, THQ, the made Titan Quest. I think it was THQ, anyway. Oh, fucking blinky scorpion cats. Alright, let's go ahead and destroy this big-ass thing. Yeah. My titles, usually I have a play on words with it. You know, like, something like, in the far future, there is only... Oh, wait, wrong game. Shh. 
should be nearing the boss of this area, I would hope. Probably not, though. Yes, yes, I love Titan Quest. That's actually... Titan Quest was actually the first game I seriously streamed. I don't want the Horfoss Jedgard to freaking hit me, please. Thank you. Like, I mean, I did a shit ton of Destiny, but it was before... That was before I became affiliated. Um, Titan Quest is actually the game that got me affiliated. And especially because, and it was right after, uh, shortly after I had gotten affiliated, they had come out and they had released the uh, Ragnarok expansion, which was totally awesome. Because it's like, hey, here's this 10-year-old game that hasn't ever seen an update since, you know, it got bought. And now all of a sudden there's this awesome expansion for it. That was a blast to play. I need to go back through and do it again with the, I'm going to do a, a Warden character or a new Hunter. Right? Oh shit. Uh, nope, 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 nope. Not hitting me. Ow, fuck, yeah, you are. Like a ton of goddamn bricks. Oh, he stuns, too. That sucks. just have to not get hit by oh shh okay don't stand in the poison got it good to know good to, uh, very good uh, what's the word I'm looking for here uh, good good suggestion don't stand in the bad stuff and this one if you like like if you like Titan quest man I don't know how much of Titan Quest you played or how much you remember of Titan Quest. Or if you enjoy Titan Quest. Oh, Charger. Fuck. That is a line of... That's ah, another one of those stupid towers. Oh, shit. No skeletons. No minion. Bad juju. Woo! <sighs> okay, um, if you have a Mortal Throne, uh, Ragnarok, really amazing fucking expansion. Really fun. Um, takes place in the Frozen North. Totally awesome. Um... And it's all Norse mythology E, and then it gives you the new, uh, one of the new uh, classes is the Rune Crafter, which is disgustingly powerful. Um, but, just to give you an idea of how similar Grim Dawn is to Titan Quest, here's the uh, skill tree. <laughs> basically an identical style and then we have devotion so like we clear shrines and then you can unlock uh, constellation powers <laughs> just a little similar ah, it's a fucking aether obelisk god I hate those stupid things can we please kill that and then please kill the Aether Obelisk. Please. No? We don't want to kill the Aether Obelisk? Okay. 
Because I, I feel like it needs to die. Before it kills me would be ideal. Pretty please? No? Okay. Go fuck myself. Got it. God damn. <laughs> yeah, right. Almost freaking photocopied. Oh, god damn. Those things suck. And I'm playing this on, uh, as of right now, I'm on elite difficulty, so these sh things hit a lot freaking harder than they used to. And I have literally no elemental resistances. I have got to be nearing the end somewhere. I don't, I can't open up freaking portals, personal portals inside these stupid things. Basically, like the uh, Diablo Rift. Which, Diablo 3 is another one I need to do some work on. I haven't played it at all this league or this season. Alright, what's down here? Besides my death. Yeah, the the Necro launch could have been a lot better. They've actually, uh, with their most recent changes, they changed a shit ton about the Necromancer. And it's actually not a one-trick pony anymore. There's two or three different really good builds for him. Thankfully. Because it was like, yeah, I'm going to buy the Necromancer because I wish they'd included it to begin with. And then, yeah, it ended up being absolutely terrible. Oh, that is no freaking bueno. Alright, so that Herald of Stars is terrifying. And me with literally no ranged abilities. This is fun. This is fun. It's fine. It's fine. Alright, let's... Bump up the physique some. God, this is going to suck so bad. I'm about to get my shit kicked in. Crack lodestone, grants lightning nova. Additional armor. What do you do? What do you do? There's some additional vitality damage. Yeah, he summons a lot of freaking help, Jesus.
Well, this is fun. Let's get frozen. This dude's gonna take me a little bit to take out. Let's see right how we saw this how we're using. Exactly. And I still, I'm still not like totally on board with the witch doctor, you know. Like I don't really like his the builds for the witch doctor. No. Oh, you motherfucker. God damn it. <laughs> now I have to run all the way back through. Son of a bitch. <sighs> Thing's only a few fucking levels higher than I am. Gotta kill it. Gotta get good loots, man. Right? Table flip. Table freaking flip. I don't have a table flip emote. I do have that one though. So break out the cannons. Go freaking pirate on his ass. Best way to go. Up through here. Oop. I missed a loot. Obviously, that was not the proper way to go. Got it. So let's shoot back through here. Go around this nasty shit. stuff apart so we gotta go this way there we go I'm assuming the herald of the stars is probably the boss of the rift at least that would be my assumption and I would hopefully be correct because if there's something bigger behind there I might as well just give up on that one Oh, no, 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 ow, ow, ow. Let's not take more damage than we have to. Right? Sounds very important. Let's hope he's important enough for them to actually make him the boss. Oh, god damn it, the thing freaking charged me. Come on. Thank you. Oh, shit, don't run through his bullshit.
He's got like no health. <laughs> God damn it. foolish thing. There we go. Oh, nope. Let the poison go away first. You know, before standing on it. Empowered wild colors decapitator. Nice two-handed axe. Jesus. It's too bad this character doesn't use two-handed axes, man. That would be wonderful. Oh, it requires a skeleton key. Son of a bitch. <sighs> now the question is, is can I find a skeleton key here? Or do I have to go find it somewhere else? nice if I could find one here. I guess there is this huge area up here I haven't finished going through. Squishy, go away. Damn it, what part of I'm squishy, go away, don't you understand? You know? Is it the English part? kidding. Gonna be like a tender, uh, a super tender freaking uh, whatever you want to call it. Popcorn shrimp or some shit. I wonder if I'll be lucky enough to find a skeleton key here. I'm gonna guess probably not. Or if I do I need to craft a skeleton key? That's the next question. see if we can craft a skeleton key real quick. I'm not even sure if I've got the freaking blueprint for a skeleton key. Alright, that's weapons, items. Those are components. Those are consumables. Nope, I can craft aether shards though. Craft skeleton key. Makes me sad. Alright. I'm 
elemental exchange. This does give me pet bonuses though, which is something that I want. Plus it's a higher, keep a hold of those. Ooh, not good. What am I short? 352. I'm short 20 points of cunning. Where can I squeeze extra cunning out of? It's not like I can't go without my damn sword. So I will just keep that over there for now. shit into the bank or into the smuggler I guess not bank necessarily keep that in that bag Jesus we got more stuff in that bag Find more stuff. It's a heavy helm. Lore bonus. See? Lore bonus just like uh, Titan Quest. check two more areas to check we'll go check this other one real quick even though getting to this one's gonna suck this one just so happens to be through this crap nope 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 no 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 we don't kill me Oh, that is a freaking ethereal abomination. Damn it. Oh, no, no, no. Stop with that. Did he just kill my freaking minions right away? Oh, there's two of them, that's why. Okay. That explains it. Oh, those stupid things, man. Alright, man. Thanks for the lurk, buddy. Thank you very much for the lurk. Lurk away. Lurkity lurk lurk.
freaking abominations. These things are tough. And no such luck on the skeleton key. Damn. Well, it looks like there's one other spot I can go to to look. So I can go over here to the east, and maybe there'll be one. I maybe I'll get lucky and pull one out of that farm field over there, but I doubt it. Damn shit, we didn't go through this one. Whoa. Hell is shooting what seems like balls of freaking aether. Oh, it's another one of those things. Okay. All right. Except he's backed up by one of those stupid things. Really, you guys are going to go on the opposite side of the wall from where I'm at. Okay. That makes a lot of sense. Makes a whole lot of sense. Holy shit. Hmm. Oh, it died. Good. I was wondering why it stopped chasing me all of a sudden. kill everything before you can move on because this whole area is freaking covered in it oh god damn there's another one Ah. up at least. <clears throat> I already destroyed the Herald of Stars that was over here. That was in this area, I guess, not over here. Damn. Nothing. No skeleton keys, nothing.
Oh shit. I don't even know where these vortexes come from. This is actually the first time I've seen them in an Aether Rift. I usually don't see them. Life givers. Ooh, hello. Someone is apparently shooting at me. something? No? Okay. Alright. Alright, we can head on out of here since I don't have a skeleton key. I can't continue past that gate. That just irritates me. So I will... See, yeah, these stupid vortexes. I'm at a total loss. Since I had never encountered them before. <clears throat> what I do know is they like to kill my freaking minions, man. A bunch of minion murdering bastards. No skeleton key, no riff, no frickin' gate. Alright. So going up there didn't do me a lick of good, really. I guess I did hit level 59, so I guess it helped a little bit. And the hitting of, the hitting of level 59 was a little painful, though. points into it. So we're right. What about Inquisitor? Does that up my cunning? It does. Don't know if that was the way to go with it. So I need something defensive. Some form of always on shield ability. Official. Let's try it out, shall we? Slave and souls. It's not going to do much at this at that level, but it may help. Oh, not with a terrible cooldown like that, it won't. Kill these bastard things, though. Can you let me click on it and pick it up? Thank you. We gotta 
kill the amal uh, I can't even pronounce the damn word amalgamation and find the cannons which I'm probably nowhere near the damn cannons to be honest I think I'm closer to the amalgamation ow dude stunned the shit out of me please thank you because I'm not keen on running through ah yes yeah, scarecrows which then turn into ethereal wraiths Waves of guys coming. Holy crap, man. Just freaking waves. Oh, that's right. Sithonic Devourers. I forgot those were in this one. Or in this act, I guess. Get our skellies back because we're down to four, and that's just a no-no. Top his health up. And let's go ahead and drop a portal. You know, so we don't have to run back and do it all over again. Oh yeah, this is the the, the bossy boy is in here. Dick. side of here. Alright, here we go. Oh, shit. Sure, come say hi. Bastard. Freaking skeletons. Oh my god, nope. There we go, we got ourselves to a little freaking hidey hole, I guess. For lack of a better term. <sighs> Alright. Alright, claimed the cannon. Ow, mother forker. Ah, yeah, another herald. God damn it, that's gonna kill me. Yep. Ah. I'm about the squishiest bastard in the damn game. I don't know if I just came to this difficulty too soon or what. Because on the initial playthrough, it freaking one-shotted every damn boss with this build. 
My gear is all 10 levels too low now, though. You know what? Let's see what we can do about that, shall we? All right, what do you got? Obviously not good stuff. Or at least not stuff that's going to work for this character right now. Let's go to Homestead and talk to them. Cannons are secured, at least. Vitality damage, chaos damage. How much is it? Thirty six, thirty seven thousand. Ballistic plate, fortitude, arcane spark. Oleron's blood. Their sparks and war blades. I'm almost up to the next rank, which will give me access to the powders and the writ. Now, once I get this one, powered crest. Oh yeah, and then you get the freaking Aether Storm powders and shit. That's awesome stuff. All right. <coughs> I really wish you would just open the damn gates and let me out that way. I have a feeling I'm going to lose a lot of experience this way. Like a fairly dumb amount. Yep, I am going to lose a lot of experience fighting that stupid thing. And it's in a really shitty spot to fight it, too. I need the Arcovian. Let's see, do you sell it? Who sells it? It's Devil's Crossing Relic. Defenses. See, like, I've got no resistances, which really sucks. I'm not worried about retaliation. <sighs> Pet bonuses, damage, life, cast speeds. Yeah, they have no chaos resistance, so they just get chewed on. Let's take a look here. If I had some lifesteal, it'd be nice. Is the seer? Yeah. Sedina's back here. Go ahead and pull those back. And those back. Get 
We don't like them. All right. So in that case, we have four available points. We could dump all four of them into this and increase the damage that this does by a lot. Um, Let's see, what is the recharge timer on this right now? So every five seconds I could throw a new unstable anomaly out that would run at him and explode. Oh shit, you can have three of them out at a time. Okay. You know what? I'm tempted. Let's let's try it. Six point seven second recharge time. don't think it's going to work out well. So yeah, we'll take the point out of that because we like our unstable anomaly just how he is. Presence of a necromancer. You unleash a ghostly whale. Terrify target for two seconds. I don't think it's going to work on that deal. Drain essence. Doesn't do a lot of damage yet. Doesn't have a lot of points, but alright. Well, let's go and try and take out this stupid Aether thing. A Herald of Flame. Or do I need to freaking go farm that shit after all? I didn't. Kill me again. Stop it with the killing of me. No! Stop. Damn it. <sighs> Seriously, I can't put Drain Essence on that one? That's dumb. It's like a primary attack, why the hell? Whatever. I mean, I guess I can always freaking do the old fashioned uh, Zerg him to death, just keep running back at him. I thought the whole point of having the freaking uh, Blight Fiend was so it would draw aggro. It doesn't seem to be doing that. It's 
got Blight Claws, he's got Virulent Death and Eldritch Fire. Making me a little salty. That's all. tempts me to just make a new character some melee focused super uber freaking tank character does wide sweeping damage attacks should die this time. I would freaking hope. <laughs> kind of makes you a little irritated. So, apostate, not a great class. Not a great class at all. Guys, we are going to go ahead and throw a raid off to my man Lumpy Noggin. He's a cool dude. Join the raid. If you got it. Copy and paste that when we get in there, man. Come on, let's go. Let's raid him. Definitely building differently though. 